Hey guys, today I'm going to be going over um, S Security Onion uh, has something that's called Kibana that's built into it. And it's just a visualization dashboard where we can see all your logs, events, um, alerts, and you can run graphs and reports. It's a very nice uh, utility within uh, Security Onion. And right now we're having this issue with Kibana status is red. Um, I've seen this a lot of a lot of cases and I see that it's just a misconfiguration with Security Onion that you just need to up the memory or heap uh, size. So I'm going to show you how to do that today. So if you keep getting this plugin, Elasticsearch, unable to connect, that means the service has crashed. Um, that hence why it's in the red status. And you can even go into SSH of that Security Onion server and you can run a simple command so-elastic-status and that's going to show you the status of the services within Security Onion and you can see everything's running fine except for the Elasticsearch um, service. So and we've already gone through our logs and we notice that it just keeps crashing because the heap level just keeps getting maxed out. You can see it's at 1.42 gigs um, and we just need to change uh, the log stash heap and that's just in the configuration file. So we're using a utility called WinSCP. And the first thing I'm going to show you is how to get into the uh, logs for security. And so once you SSH or uh, WinSCP, use that program so you can SSH into uh, the Linux box and you can see the file structure. I find this is the easiest way to edit files and uh, get to where you need to go. So go to um, var. And then you need to go to log and then go to Elasticsearch. Now this is going to be uh, the log files for the past um, couple of days, but this is going to be the latest one. So we're going to copy this over here. We're going to overwrite it since we've already copied it over there. Then we're going to go to open up that directory. And we're going to open it up in Notepad++. And you can see here's all of our error messages. But like I said, we've already gone through all this. You might have something different, but we find that we just need to give it more memory. So I'm going to go ahead and just close out of this. I just want to show you where the log files are at. So maybe you might have a new issue. Um, sometimes this issue will go away if you just reboot the sec uh, security on your server. Um, but it's probably best to you know find out why it's doing that. Um, so that's why you want to go in that log file first. Um, now to change your memory, we can go into etc. And then you need to go to nsm and then you're going to find security onion .config. now this is the actual config file uh, for security onion so we're going to copy this over here I recommend making a backup just in case um, so if something goes wrong you can just restore that original config so here's our config for our server and we're going to try and find um, I'm pretty sure it's just we should be able to find it by just typing in heap. Yeah. So you can see ours is set to four gig. That should be fine. The log stash heap is set for one gig. So let's change that to two. And let's actually change this to six. Uh, Cause we have um, 16 gigs on this server. So we're gonna dedicate six gigs for this, two gigs for that, and that should be fine. So we're gonna save that file. Close out of notepad plus plus. Close out of here. And like I said, you want to make up a backup. So I'm just going to rename this to BK for backup. And then we're going to write this over back to here with those changes that we made. And then we can come over here to reboot our security onion. I'm just going to type in reboot. And it's disconnected our SSH tunnel. And this has, of course has disconnected. So we're gonna wait for that to reboot, and then we should be able to load up our security onion back and log in, and everything should be running just fine. So this is how you can maybe get around this elastic search issue. Um, I haven't really found much online about it, but I, I find if I just adjust those two um, settings uh, that everything's fine. But of course, if you're running a big environment, you might need to go higher than what I did. Um, I only have a you know 40 uh, endpoint network, so uh, I don't have to have it that high. Um, just follow the changes uh, with uh, so-elastic-restart, 
and see if the services come back up. Or sometimes I just like doing an actual hard reboot, which is what I just did. Um, if it does not work, then you just need to increase the 6 gigs to something bigger. And then log stash heap to something bigger as well. And then just restart your services. Or like I said, you can actually just reboot the entire server. I like to just do a clean reboot. Um, just to see if there's anything else pending. Um, and it's also good to do um, any updates as well during this time to uh, fully update your security on your server as well. Thanks, you guys. Hope this was helpful.